Greetings, blessings and joy, this is Seth. Noise. You are surrounded by noise. But within you is a stillness. At the center of your being, in the core of your heart, is the peace, the calm at the eye of the storm. Maybe you do not agree, maybe you feel that there is much turbulence within you, your thoughts refuse to settle, you are agitated, you are anxious. This channel has attempted many times to find pleasant places in which to bring us in, as well as the other teachers, to give you messages of peace, of joy, of connection and community, and to embrace your power, to embrace your divine spark. And so often he has felt thwarted in these efforts because of the lack of peace, where he thought he might find some. We've asked him to set up here. There is a road directly behind us. Even though this physical setting would seem to be a small temple, it is far from peaceful. You can hear the sounds of the vehicles driving mere feet from this location. And yet, here we are. A moment of calm and peace, surrounded by disturbance, surrounded by chaos. If you were constantly waiting for that peace to come to you, you will be waiting a very long time. You have not incarnated in an era of peaceful energy. You are in one of the most turbulent eras of this planet. And yet, peace can be found. Peace can be found within you. These trials, these distractions, all of the disturbances that you wish would cease so that you could find your moment of peace, these are the gift, this obstacle to overcome, to be able to find peace amidst the chaos. This is why many of you incarnated into this moment in time. In this way, you are becoming even stronger. In this way, you are becoming more powerful. Embrace the chaos. Embrace the noise. It is here as a companion, a friend, even a guide. You must find your own balance. You cannot allow any one other being to dictate what that balance is for you. But when you learn to find the peace, even in the midst of the storm, you begin carrying that peace consciously through the rest of your life. There is a friendly insect buzzing at this channel's ear. It is curious. It wishes to participate in this field of energy. And it is a distraction for this channel. And yet, it remains. He is learning to channel in the midst of distraction. He is embracing this lesson in this moment. 
Look for the area of your life where you can embrace your challenges, where you can embrace your distractions to grow stronger and more resilient despite the storm raging around you. When you carry that peace into the rest of your life, it will radiate out. Others will become aware of the peace at your core, which you have tapped into. You will become an island in the storm as you draw others to yourself, sharing your light, sharing your peace. Blessings, love and joy, peace and light. This was Seth. Well, I say all the time how I'm on a journey with you and you are very much on that journey with me today. I am attempting to embrace the chaos. Oh gosh. This is an idyllic park, but it's so situated next to this busy road. And I questioned, maybe I should move on. Maybe I should try channeling somewhere else. And Seth said, embrace the chaos, embrace the noise. And I didn't understand why until he started to speak. So thank you, Seth. And thank you all for joining me on this lesson today. I hope you can embrace your chaos and find your peaceful center at the heart of it all. And I hope that you are able to carry that forward into the world. Thank you for watching today. And thank you for subscribing or sharing these videos with those who you think could benefit from their message. I'll see you next time. This was Daniel Zafer-Joyce for Universal.